What is going to be the outcome in terms of another 15 years down the road if these, if these vote numbers continue to go in the way they are? <laughs> I'd like not to think about the worst case scenario. Um, <laughs> uh, again, we've, all, we've already uh, witnessed that in, uh, at uh, some provincial and especially municipal level where you see a voter turnout uh, in many municipalities be below 30%. Uh, the thing it does is that it, uh, Canadians deny themselves, not voting, deny yourself to make government ac accountable to choose your government, to choose the ideas that uh, you value, and choose the representative that will convey your, uh, your ideas and values. Is there, just a little follow-up. Is there a critical point that we reach then with voting turnout that it's no longer relevant and it really isn't representative of the population? Maybe, but again, the democracy is based on on the mandate given by those who vote. That's the problem with not voting. If you don't vote, you don't have a say in the affairs of your, uh, in the affairs of the state, in the affairs of your government. So again, as long as there are people voting, in theory, <laughs> they will be elected official. 